Two guys set out to ride across the country with nothing but their backpacks and their bicycles. WVUA 23's Audra Phillips was able to catch up with them on their way through town. Tasman Alexander and Tyler Brown started their bike packing trip on September 24th from San Francisco and will finish in Charleston, South Carolina. But now we're just doing this for ourselves. Uh, this trip was for fun to meet people and see the places around the country. Ideally, when someone's taking a cross country trip, they take a car or a plane. But for these guys, they're taking their bikes. So I've done a few smaller trips around a week. Um, but so this is my first long trip, uh, especially over a thousand miles. We're probably about over 3,000 in right now. I uh, got a few hundred more to, to the East Coast, but that's mine. Um, and Taz has done a few uh, long ones. He did Oregon to Fort Collins. Getting ready for the trip is just as much work, but Brown says the most important part is figuring out the right path. In terms of preparation, navigation was kind of like the big thing, like where are we going to go? So for the first two weeks, we had kind of a pretty good idea of where we were going to be and how we were going to get there. But past that, we've kind of just been winging it. Um, we kind of have a destination or a city that we want to end up in and however long it takes us to get there within reason is is how we go. Along the way the duo said the different people they've met has been the best part. Everybody is extremely generous no matter what part of the country you're in and especially being in not the west um, midwest and south and all that I've really love the absolute generosity. That but the ride isn't always so nice. The duo said the encounters between cars and animals call for some extra protection. Oftentimes it's cars and since we've hit Oklahoma and Arkansas, dogs, they really like chasing us. Um, we have yet to pick up mace, though we often wish we did. I mean, we, we get chased by dogs on a daily basis and sometimes, <laughs> you know, we'll get a couple of German Shepherds and a pit bull on the same street. That happened to them to him the other day. To keep up with their journey, follow Tasman Alexander on YouTube. Reporting for WVUA 23 News, I'm Audra Phillips.